So there I was, casually just finished my Mario Kart map that you should totally get, by the way. And I was thinking, did I forget something? And then I looked back at my computing post. I did. So that's what I'm going to do today. My very first Q&A. I didn't really get that many comments about it, but a good place to start. I might do another one in the future, but in case I do, leave comments down below asking ask me any questions that you may have that weren't already answered in this video. So, my first question is, the top three songs I would recommend to people. Now, at least one of these are found in the game, of course. Like, I played games for like almost all my life, so, I mean, I, I'm bound to have at least one song that came from a game, and yeah. So like one song I would a song I would like request I would like suggest people listen to because oh my god is Want You Gone by Aperture Science from Portal Two. I never played I never I like, recorded any gameplay of it, but I played a lot of Portal Two back in the day. And I finished the game multiple times. That very music came up, and I was. Uh, so if you have any time, search up "Want You Gone" by Aperture Science, or just "Want You Gone" in Portal Two or whatever. Take a listen. It's pretty good. I never played Portal One, but I only played Portal Two. So and between all the all the music I've listened to, "Want You Gone." Is my favorite out of the three. Because it's like three, like three, three songs from Portal. So, <laughs> I do, out of the three, I recommend most while you're gone. I would also recommend Doesn't Mean Anything by Alicia Keys. That was one of the very first songs I ever listened to as a child. And I can thank my mom for that because she's the reason why I even know that song in the first place. I think I was listening to it not that long ago, actually. And my third song, and a third song I would recommend people listen to, I would say, I had it in my head a second ago. Bad Day. Specifically, the version from Alvin and the Chipmunks. I only heard a little snippet of it, but long before I, I heard the full thing, and that was my top song, like 2011. Next up, how did I get my name? Long story short, Twitter. Short story long, I used this application called Twitter. It was, well, at least in the community I was in, a pretty weird place. And one day, I decided to ask, what name could I give my YouTube channel? Like, I would like a new name that you any of y'all have any ideas. And the one that caught my attention was Creeper Cave. I'm being dead when I say that, by the way. The, that I definitely expected is my new name, but over time, it kind of kind of wanted to add something to it. Something didn't feel right about it. And so I decided to change his uh, Creeper part to Prepper. The uh, Prepper Cave. And I felt like the the last last part of the name was missing something too. I feel like I could add like an A sound. So Pepper Cave. I didn't like think about how to spell it until a little bit after I figured out the pronunciation. The first it was like Pepper Cave with an A Y. So yeah, it was it was weird weird. I think it was a weird way of getting my name from the Twitter. Next up. Could you tell us your YouTube channel history? Oh boy. No, I was. A young lad sitting in my, sitting in my basement. Good old 2015. You know what? I'm going to make a YouTube channel and I'm going to get famous. Of course, that didn't live up all that well. As I'm only, as I'm only a third of the way to a thousand subscribers as of right now, I decided to record some content. And at first, it wasn't really gaming, it was more plush content. Because at the time, I was watching a lot of Super Mario Logan and other related 
YouTube channel. I thought, maybe I could, maybe I could close this video with my mom plush, and since I have a lot of those. And so I did. For a little bit. Before I deleted them all. But, there are a couple that are still up on a completely different channel that is way older than this one. <laughs> I'm sure you can find it. I'm not gonna, not gonna embarrass myself by giving you the name of it though. <laughs> so, but one thing I was, I am going to say is that it's about plushes. Fighting. Like a good long period of time, I was actually on Minecraft, but on Minecraft PlayStation 3. Because like, remember, at the time, I don't think Bedrock existed. And the one thing I did when I got home from school, go on my PlayStation, Load up Minecraft, Lovely Planet, or whatever I had on my PlayStation at the time. Yeah, I did play a bunch of Minecraft when I was younger, and now nah, that's all I play. <laughs> and then, like you see, console version came and went, and now I had the Bedrock version of it, where I would record these content off of that. That's actually where I started high, actually. With a good amount of clips from early January of 2020 to around October. 2020, I was mainly on Nintendo Switch. And then from there on until summer this year, I was on keyboard and mouse Xbox. Really long road. Occasionally I went on PC, but I went back. But recently I lost subscription again, and I figured it's not worth it to keep paying these people to pay online. So here I am now on PC. Fun as it is, literally, uh, what you see right now is not actually uh, live gameplay. It's actually gameplay that I recorded after I recorded me talking here. Because the last time I tried this, it was lagging horribly, and I don't want lagging content for you guys. So I mean, for YouTube's sake, for YouTube, uh, it's practically the same. I, when I was playing on play, Minecraft PlayStation Three. I let that be known. <laughs> God, that's my channel. I don't know. I, I played quite a few videos on PlayStation 3 that I think you can still find on my channel to this day. Of course, they're not as high quality because... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm allergic to talk about my own old content. But yeah, you can still find some other content. Find some of my old content on PlayStation 3. Of course, it's not going to be as high quality because... It was literally me recording my phone at the TV, since again, I didn't have a screen recorder at the time, and just me doing random stuff. I did find a glitch that probably got patched because of me. Time flies, and uh, here I am now on Xbox, uh, no, PC Minecraft. Next up, what is my main language? You can hear it right now. To be honest, I kind of want to learn Japanese, but at the same time, I'm kind of lazy. One day I'll probably uh, probably end up like studying it or something, but as of right now, I don't know. Where was I born? Well, dear viewer, I was born as a Delawarean. I was born in Delaware and still I am in Delaware. Like there was a brief period where I lived in Maryland, but like I came right back to Delaware. Next up, what place are you in H and S leaderboard? Fourth place. Thank Mr. Clowby. I kind of started to get bored of Hyde since, you know, there was no updates. So, like, I was really only getting on Hyde just to keep myself in third place. Because Clowby was right on my tail, and I, I didn't really want him to get third. But then I just kind of gave up on that and just said, you know what, you win. <laughs> get, get third, whatever. Hey. Yeah, if you look at the leaderboard, I am not going to be able to catch up to Cloudy anytime soon. Unless I literally play for like 12 hours each day, I'm not going to be able to get that back anytime soon. Anyway, why am I so cool? What do you mean? I don't think I'm... Uh... Yeah, so like you're asking the wrong person that question. The P is the high. So, uh... Lately, it's been getting more difficult making content for it. Especially for like Hyde. At least, thankfully, now they gave me more ideas since they added two new maps, Chime and Harvest. I mean, to keep up with my reputation of getting 15 kill games on every map, I have to continue. And once I get those, I guess it, I guess it uh, makes sense to make a montage out of it again. Oh boy, how does it compare to what I made like 
half a year ago. So, yeah. I might make a mod touch. Again, out of 50 kills. If I do end up getting that. Do I own a guild on MC? A what? How old am I? Uh... I am a senior in high school. You kind of get an estimate of my age from that. And lastly, why did you choose hide and seek over everything else? Well, hide and seek just really caught my attention the most, and I figured I could make content off of it more than everything else. Also, because I want to be unique, you know what I'm saying? Most people on Hive tend to make content on Treasure Wars, Sky Wars, Arcade, or something like that. But me, no, I, I'm gonna make some hide content, god dang it. Anywho, that was all the questions I got. Hope you guys enjoyed the little video. If you did, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe for more content similar to this. Normally I don't do a Q&A, so similar would be better than just like, you know what I'm saying? Also, ring that notification bell, ring that subscribe button, so you know every time I upload a brand new video to the channel. Hey, you could even get your comment featured in another Q&A I do in the future. So, you might want to send me any questions you have in the comments down below to where you have a chance to gain your comment featured in my next Q&A. And with that, I'm Crippo Cave. I'll see you guys in the next video.